Hello everybody from the Ligonier, Pennsylvania Dollar Tree. We are traveling, so we popped in really quick to see what's new. Let's get into it. If you've never seen the Ligonier, Pennsylvania Dollar Tree, I'm just giving you a quick pan around. It is a nice one. Beautifully lit. Pretty well stocked considering, you know. So let's get into some Halloween right at the front. I love these door hangers. You know what I love about them is the jingle bells aren't super duper loud, but they do make a nice little ping. Perfect. You can add them to a wreath. And did you see those balloons, how cute they were with the little faces on them? Adorable. Next, LA Color Slip and Eye Studio. I love it when they have these kind of standalone um, stations for LA Colors lipstick because you always know that that's the trend for right now and it is. Look at those beautiful fall colors. Beautiful warm colors. They have some lip oil if you have dry lips. And look how pretty this color is. It's like a like a coppery gold from Flower which is uh, Drew Barrymore's makeup line and that's worth way more than a dollar guys. And also look at these. If I have not tried the Big Lash from LA Colors, if you have, leave me a comment down below. Let me know, is it worth buying or not? All right, back into some more Halloween. This is more like, I consider this kind of stuff perfect for um, pinatas or if you're doing a Halloween party for older children, not older children, maybe elementary school kids. Um, just cute little favors to put in bags. Oh, in disguise glasses and a clown one. <laughs> Next up, some super cute little um, mini Halloween buckets and some shot glasses. Those are plastic, by the way. And a bunch of eyeballs and pumpkin carving kits, which I really like. More kind of spooky Halloween, um, just little, what would I call them, tchotchkes, little, little trinkets for parties. And this is so cool because look how cool it looks at night love that some more press wood um, plaques that you can decorate how you like or leave as is you could stain them paint them giant eyeballs to put in trees or um where to put them i put them on like a garage door or in a bush i think that would be super fun or in a big tall tree if you do a halloween tree some dia de muertos stuff some new stuff i hadn't seen before and we're into the spooky skeleton um stem glasses and some lanterns super cute if you're doing like a lu halloween luau theme and i love this cute little mat for a dollar hello fall with the little red truck that's so famously popular some beautiful bright silk mums and some poinsettias i love that dark rich red these are adorable they remind me of when i was a kid Remember, everybody's grandma had a set of matching salt and pepper shakers, and they had owl ones, some little skinny pumpkins, and I think those are squirrels. Yeah, squirrels. So cute. I just can't believe they're a set for only a buck. That is a great deal. Let's check out the candles really quick. Your basic candle, basic votives, but this pomegranate lily one in the jar, so pretty. Yeah, and just some more package candles in little glass containers. Uh, of course, always check those strips because there's lighters. And these are really cool. You can make candles yourself. And they had four different scents. Really, really fun because you can layer them however you like. Here's a quick peek at an end cap that just has like body lotion, body spray, um, travel sets, which are perfect for me because I travel a ton. And a quick peek at some socks. They they had some, you can see, shelves are looking pretty bare in the sock department, but they did have like foot powder. And they had a lot of really cute um, polo. Like I think it's called US Polo Association. Beverly Hills Polo Club, sorry. Um, smaller kid socks. And then these I've never tried. Best Health Cough Drops and Vitamin C Drops. If you've tried them guys, let me know in the comment section. Let me know how they taste. Are they worth buying? And these I loved. I found beautiful hair clips. Oh my gosh, they're so gorgeously like 1920s retro style, which I love. I like how that one, you just pinch it. This is kind of like one of those snap clips that you bend and snap. <laughs> and then they had that cute yellow one. Yeah, and I got all three. I just love them. 
makeup section was looking a little bare. I think all the new stuff was up front, and I already showed you the LA colors. Um, but they did have a super, super decent e.l.f. Um, liner brush. Look at that. And it's um, tipped, what do they call it, angled, so it's easier to line your eyes. Those double kind of gloves, super cute. They're just cute to keep on stock in case your kids lose a pair or you're like me and I always lose a single glove. Um, taking a look at the car and automotive um, hardware section, same stuff, but I did find this and I love it. You can just turn your can upside down, strain all the liquid out, you're good to go without losing half of it down the drain. They had a ton of instant oatmeal, and guys, I have tried the maple and brown sugar. I tried the pumpkin spice. It's really, really good. Uh, I love it. I make it with uh, water and then put some milk in it. Awesome. They're back to stocking Toastum Pop-Tarts. I guess they call, they're called Toaster Pastries, right? Not Pop-Tarts. That's the brand name. A ton of cute adorable fuzzy socks ah oh, i love buying these even if they only last a, like a year so worth it because you know for a buck you can walk out on the porch like i do or go and check the mail on the porch like i do without putting your shoes on i know mama i know always put the shoes on anyway guys that'll do it for now here's a quick picture of ligonier Pennsylvania and one of the places that we hiked to. Oh man, what a beautiful spot. Um, if you've been to Ligonier or you've hiked in the Laurel Highlands, let me know in the comment section below what your favorite hike is. And until next time, thank you so much for checking out my latest Dollar Tree shop with me. Bye!